Yes, good afternoon. I'm Jeff Richardson. I'm the global head technician for Rocon, and I also have a dealership in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. This bike here is, is my R&D bike. I try out every, every new concept we can, listening to the other guys and also finding things myself. For a start, the bike has LED headlights, LED turn signals, LED stop and tail light. This bike is street legal. It is tagged. It has a portable spotlight you can take off and plugs into the 12 volt accessory plug on the side. It has mirrors because it's street legal. It also has a horn which is louder than most horns. It has a heat temperature sensor so I can tell the temperature of the heat of the head. It has a hour meter rev counter or tachometer. It has a speedometer with turn signal uh, indicators telling me which turn signal I'm on. It has a Garmin GPS on one side which is topo. On this side it uses a street legal, a street map for when I'm in the woods or when I'm out of the woods. And because it's street legal, I can go on county maintained roads such as this without getting a fine. I can also use it to go back and forth to the gym every day as a work bike. It has street legal DOT approved knobby tires, which are good in the dirt and the sand and the mud and the snow, but also you can use them on the street legally. It has the upgraded accessory, the retro seat. It has the battery mounted high, a lithium iron battery by Battery Tender. It has a snorkel so I can run deeper than most Rokons. Most Rokons can run 24 inches. This can go right up to, to here. It has this accessory, which is the ammo boxes, which unscrew and clip right off. It has the game carrier or extent uh, carrying tray. And it comes with this little netting. And then you can fit your chainsaw or whatever, or a deer, a, a 70 pound deer or hog with the legs hanging over the side. Then I also mounted magnets onto the bottom of this waterproof Bass Pro case. I have uh, an emergency medical kit with trauma pack and everything else. Then I have the original factory seat, which I also put magnets on and springs to make it a little softer ride for the passenger, which clips right in like that. It has the factory option tow bar, and I made this accessory, which undoes with two wing nuts so that you can make it a, a rigid tow bar which is required when when you're towing so the trailer doesn't come up and hit the hit the tail light and smash it if somebody should stand on the end of the trailer. Uh, you can when you're going over a log though you don't want it fixed because that could hold you up on the log so you want the chain to, to go up and down. This is for putting a, a tall flag on it so when you're going through the woods other riders can see you on trails, which are two-way trails. The um, engine is by NR Racing. It is uh, upgraded to 12 horsepower. It's balanced. And uh, it, this also has a bigger clutch on it to take the 12 horsepower. And it has uh, these turn finger screws 
to make it easier, you don't need a half inch wrench like you do on a standard one. So there's the, the bigger clutch. This, this driven clutch is a whole inch bigger. And the idea of this bigger engine is so I can go faster on the street when I'm using it on the street. This is, uh, has my wet gear in it, if it's raining, which fits in there. Tell them about the antenna. The antenna on the front is, a, is just a dummy antenna, but I'm the head range captain at the Fort Lauderdale Archers, and as we go from target to target butts through the woods, the big banana spiders, you know, about that size, are, have webs. So this breaks the web away before it goes onto my helmet. Otherwise, they splatter on my helmet or catch on my helmet. So um, this uh, also has upgraded carbon fiber looking guards. It also has handbrake, which the factory offer. So you can lock both hand, uh, both. Uh, this is the rear brake, this is the front brake, and you can lock them on. It also has a Scott dampener I'm trying out for very rough roads and also sugar sand. The idea is where the, the tire, front tire is going over rough terrain like that, this dampens, dampens the shock out of it. it, it would, if you hit a log or something, it won't just jar back on you, it'll, it will dampen it. 